Breaking news, guys. Trouble for Wiki as he's linked with brutal killings of four soldiers, kidnapping of foreign expatriates. This is really very serious. So, a group of assassins attacked a war worker convoy in River State, resulting in the abduction of two company as expatriates and the death of four soldiers and two civilians on Tuesday at approximately 9.30 a.m. The incident transpired at the Ahoda as it along the east-west road. The convoy was an en route to Yenegua, the capital of Bayasa State, when it was ambushed by Assassin, according to the report. The Assassin pursued the expatriate laborers along the Akoda Abu Road while they were being accompanied by military. They then opened fire upon them. It is reported that the assassin transversed the Emosu waterside by way of Oroshi River. The Nigerian Army 6th Division confirmed the assault and the fatality among the personnel. The soldiers belonged to the 5th Battalion, Battalion as of this moment. The suspects remain undetected. Efforts are contentions to locate them. Biafra Commander Simon Ekba, in retaliation for the barbaric murders of trans transporters and soldiers, he revealed a, a sterling secret. He urged Governor Nwike to issue an immediate order to his pre perpetrators in River State to release the two South Korean who had been the two South Koreans who had been adopted in that state. The adoptees, according to Ekwa, are criminals who are devoted to Nwike to ensure their release. The Biafra government has proposed a collaborative effort with South Korea. However, intelligence gathering has confirmed that the two construction workers were adopted by Nwike alleged criminals subsequent to the murder of their security escort. The occurrence has engendered apprehensions regarding the security landscape in River State, where criminal activities have reported recently ceased to decline. The assault could potentially be interpreted as retaliation for military operations that occurred in the vicinity approximately a fortnight ago, during which ammunition and weapon were seized. Major General Jamil Adusalami, the Joint Task Force South South General Officer, commanding uh, of Sixth Division Nigerian Army Land Component Commander of Operation Delta State, condemned the unwarranted attack and reaffirm that efforts are going, going on to apprehend the perpetrators and hold, their, hold them accountable for their wrongdoings. It is re respectfully requested that the general public furnish reliable and practical intelligence that may result in the apprehension of these wrongdoers. The persistence of the military in the Niger Delta region will not cease until every type of criminal activity, including militancy, oil tape, and pipeline, pipeline vandalization is successfully eradicated. The incident has been reported to the Embassy of the Republic of Koran, to, uh, to the, the Federal Republic of Nigeria. It is anticipated that the government of South Korea and uh, Biafra will work together to ensure the liberation of the two construction workers. Urgent attention is required to address the security situation in River State in order to avert a re recurrence of such attacks to ensure the welfare of citizens and expatriates 
while addressing the security challenges facing the state, the government should implement proactive measures. Okay. And this is the writer's view. Well, uh, River, uh, the Simon Ekba said, uh, addition to the, to the blue report, he said, we are calling on Wiki to order his criminals in River State to immediately release the two South Koreans that was kidnapped in River State. Our intel has confirmed that the kidnappers are criminals loyal to Wiki. The Biafran government has offered to collaborate with South Korea to secure their release. However, our intelligence gathering has confirmed that the criminals lawyer to Mwike kidnapped the two construction workers after killing their security escort. Embassy of the Republic of Korea to the Federal Republic of Nigeria take note. Every Biafran should tag the South Korean government. Okay, this is uh, Simon Ekba. Well, Nigerians, um, which one do you believe? Because you see these politicians, <laughs> the more you look, the less you see. You cannot just say, oh, what they said is a lie. Mm -hmm. These people, they can do anything. So guys, let's hear from you. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. If you're just joining us, please subscribe. To this channel and don't forget to give us a thumbs up thank you